Hello, welcome to Talk915. Today's video is going to show you how to download the QQ and how to sign up with QQ and guide you how to use the QQ. The first step, we use the browsers and we go to Google. When you are in Google, search QQ International. In normally, we should collect the first link due to the maintenance of the QQ International homepage instead of using the second link. When we're in the second link, we can see the download, there's a different surf. So this time we choose Hong Kong surf. Normally when you open this page, it should be in Chinese. If you want to change the language, go to the right side to choose English. Now we press download. And choose the system you are. My one is Windows. When you press download, then you can get the app and you can run that when after you download. Sign up is here. You need to enter your personal information here and press sign up. You should provide the email address and phone number in the second page during the registrations. Okay, now you should know how to download and sign up with the QQ. After you download that, and install that, it should be in your dev store. Now we try how to use that. So press your username, account number here, and your password here. Now, I think I made a mistake. Now, your successful login. This is your page when you log into QQ. So if you don't want that, on your desktop, you can push on the top. When you release, it's just hiding. And when you press there, it comes back. How to add people? Press these icons. So I do the example for you. When you press here, so let's show you example how to add our UK office QQ. This is the UK office number. So when your students and whatever office or some friends, they're providing their account number, then you can add it in here. Press the number and press the search. So you will see the people in this list and press add to contacts and send some message here. The next. Now, all you need to do is put in which group you want. For example, put in the careers and next. <coughs> okay. So, how to check your message in here? There's a flashing here. Okay, now we receive the information from the QQ. You should receive it in English. We press agree. Press here. <coughs> then now both of you are friends. The message showing you the talk 915 UK office has add you as a contact. Then finish or chat, whatever you want. Then now you can send a message to each other. So I have logged into QQ accounts to show you the examples. For example, now I'm sending message to the QQ office. Hello. Yeah, the flashing, it, look at the flashing. You can check a message here. So if someone call you, there's a message it will show up here. Double click. I received a hello from here. 
how to make a video call and how to video an audio calls. So you see there's a two button here. This button is for the audio calls and this button is for video calls. If we press start videos, then you can have video calls with students. Remember, this tools is a main tools you're using to contact our management teams and the customer services. Also, what I'm going to show you, you can, if you have any problems, you don't know how to do that, you don't know how to solve that, that is on your screen. You can do the screen chart, screenshot here to show what problem you have. Press here, show your screen. Double click, send, and then we can receive your pictures. I think this is all you know about how to use the QQ. Okay, we check here again. Yeah, we received your pictures. So it's very simple. It literally just same like a Skype, but just a Chinese versions of Skype. It's a Chinese applications. Hope you understand how to use the QQ and download the QQ now. Thanks for the watchings.